Good morning. Uh, welcome to dot programming dot blogspot dot com. Uh, today I'm talking about introduction to MVC uh, or Hello World applications. A simple Hello World applications. So first of all, open Visual Studio 2012, 10, 2013, 2015. I have Visual Studio 2013. So let's to start by using Visual Studio to create a simple application in MVC in ASP.NET MVC ok uh, yeah first of all oops uh, Visual Assist is expire uh, now select the file menu in the file menu we have uh, multiple options like the create new website new project and many more things I select project in the project I select web applications select to web and that is ASP.NET web application you can change your framework uh, .NET framework uh, I have 4.6 you can also earlier version to use ok now in the select empty project and MVC ok now click to ok button actually uh, MVC stands for model view controller and the model represents the classes uh, you have to take in the project and uh, view means the representation or you can say the presentation model where you present your web page and the controller is a class through which we can control all over the projects and all over the model and views so in this lesson I will discuss about the controller because the default is render on the browser that is controller so I have these files views model controller application start file application uh, start folder application data folder basically uh, these folder are very important so uh, discussed to open a new project that is web application uh, that default template which is provided by Microsoft okay so open new project ASP.NET application this uh, the same thing web form uh, MVC in earlier I select empty but here we select MVC that is the empty folders uh, application data folder application start folder application data it means we can store databases okay application start means uh, the start uh, file inside here uh, we can set the start page through the application start file that is the route config.cs file ok that is here later discuss on uh, controller action and id that is the default controller is home action is index and id is this id is optional parameter so doesn't uh, include in in this lesson controller is empty model empty and views empty but here we have the full web template provided by Microsoft inside we have a uh, some controllers some views that is these are the file that is the default page these are the fo uh, folders the same folders but controller we have uh, three files that is account controller home controller and manage controller the home controller is the start page of your web uh, of your application the index uh, when we check in the route config file route config.cs where we find that home is a starting page it's not a startup these are the mentions uh, assemblies in the startup file actually 
we have the start point of uh, the project is uh, route config dot cs file the start method is index now check it in by the google chrome we will discuss these all things using empty project clearly we all uh, we learn all such things using empty project okay but here we can check the output of mvc application which is provided by microsoft this is the default template provided by microsoft it's a beautiful template which is contains css and the mobile configuration css let's check it's take time uh, take time to load the application in the browser uh okay this is the home controller is a default uh, controller and the first method to render in the browser that is the index method and index return the view actually the view uh, inside in the view folder where uh, the index view is the default name that is the default page home index not found that is the home yeah that is the name of the controller actually it's not a in method of the page that is the name of the controller home so please uh, pass in the url as a controller name only it's not a uh, pass to method name pass only controller name okay fine uh, let's check to about the view that is the home view and where we have index view the page yeah the, this is the page uh, this is the default page render first time on the browser a uh, getting started asp.net mvc give you a powerful pattern based uh, way to build dynamic websites that enable a client subscription of the concerts view back dot title returns the title of the page that is home page this is all such things later we discuss in each folders one by one and take uh, these things so first of all in the empty project that is one first of all create a controller right click on it and add a new controller for that is your first tutorial to create a controller add it the name of the controller is home click to add button okay this is the home controller okay that is the home view okay if you want to display the hello world message then return the string only uh, instead of view so return string hello world okay semicolon yeah that's it the default controller is render on the browser that is home and first method that is render that is index so return hello world on the page screen this is your first page which is displayed on the browser yeah that is in the next lesson i will discuss about multiple page and how to change the startup start page among the pages and multiple pages i set the startup page okay so thank you thank you very much for watching this video tutorial please keep watching my all mvc tutorials thank you thank you very much